Uh, had a matchup with a Sagat player, Soup Ladle. Pretty good. B+. Plus. You see the points. Solid. I've played him before in the past. So, um, you know, it's a little bit of familiarity. But I can't remember what his style was like. I think it's, uh, I thought it was more of a running the gauntlet. Which, you know, I'm not completely far off. Which is what it is with a lot of Sagat players. But... Um, I don't remember what the outcome was in the past, but uh, you'll see what it is here. So, yeah, I was still in troll mode in the first round. And I was like, uh, yeah, I'm going to jump as much as I want to and do what I need to do. And walk up, try to walk up bingo and all this stuff. And I don't know, but... Uh, I was able to land that at the end of the round. Whereas I'm not going to be like, oh my goodness, yellow bar. Nah, I'm not that type of cat. Because I've been perfected, but still won after that. It's not, it's not how you start, it's how you finish. So, Tiger Shot. In Japanese, sounds like Tiger Soap. And, of course, it sounds like when he does Ultra One, eat breakfast. I mean, you know. Everybody know that one. Should know that one. But, uh, Cody got a little loose in that round. A little loose. Gauntlet time. Uh, I'm waiting for something. Waited for that. Uh, he caught me by surprise. Man, sometimes a Sagat matchup is flat out boring. Tiger shot, tiger soap, tiger soap. Ah, man. And then you have to sit back and then you gotta go through the gauntlet or avoid it and make Sagat come to you. Hey, breakfast. Needed some space. In those situations, you really can't sweat. You gotta know what you're gonna do, when you're gonna do it. So that was premeditated, I planned that out. But uh, very good match, man. Good game, dog.